Hello again, everyone. My name is Chet, and this is Chet Chat. This is a very dry weekend, so I was just, you know, looking for a movie to talk to you guys about, and I always wanted to watch one of these. I've seen a few of them before, but the movie I saw is Katamar... 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 Yeah. So I don't know if it's politically correct to call it a Bollywood movie anymore because I remember this girl complained about it being called a Bollywood movie, but I don't know. For us layman people, I guess, I don't know. Bollywood. So I always see these kind of YouTube clips of Bollywood action scenes where they're way over the top and they're crazy looking. It's like super awesome martial arts in them. So when I saw this movie, just looking at the poster of like the guy, I was like, I think this is going to be one of those crazy action movies. So I want to go and check it out. I've seen Bollywood movies before and one, like there's a few, there's three things you should know actually in a Bollywood movie there is they're, they're very long they're very long movies because they make time to give you these huge performance pieces of just dancing and music and it's like maybe five to ten minutes long for each dance and each video and there's probably like eight to ten of them in the whole movie between actual plot so these movies could go over like two and a half hours to three hours long because they have to have these dancing numbers in the movie and number three is going to have some loss in translation bit there's some cultural differences that you might not understand there's a lot of things i didn't understand in this movie in their society there's like katamas and rayudos and just the way how it, like they speak with each other and there's like jokes there's sayings there's like idioms and all kinds of different things that i didn't know like they, they translated it in english for me but i'm like i don't know what they mean when they say this so a lot of the jokes i felt like i didn't get because i didn't i don't know the culture and i wish i knew because the movie is kind of cool like i really really like the movie is weird so the movie is about a few things like there's this guy he's Kadama Ryudo KR I'm gonna call him KR from now on you got KR and he pretty much runs this little village and he has these four brothers and they're super cool guys and they're super badass man in the beginning of the movie they just show like you know there's this villain driving down to the village he, he wants to do a deal and he, he needs to pass through the village to do this deal and the KR is like nah I don't like you and I don't want to deal with you and then the guy's like yo you better deal with me and he just whoops his ass like two moves he and like he does it like in a seated position and the action is so cool the cinematography is like so crazy Bollywood they know what they're doing with this cinematography man oh my god it's so cool but yeah so he's running this village and his brother is actually like women and KR doesn't like romance so they try to give him they try to make him fall in love because the KR doesn't like love in his village straight up so if somebody falls in love he kicks them out and they could go and fall in love somewhere else so they think that if they make him fall in love he will accept love in the village but other than that the people that you see KR beat up in the beginning they team up with a prior villain that KR beat up before and they want to collaborate to take down the KR um, that's all I'm gonna say about the movie for now I think the acting is over the top and cool because it fits the, like the cinematography is just so like fast paced and they, they, they focus on like like so many minute little things and the action is way over the top and because of the fast pacedness it feels like the director knew that he has to fit in a certain amount of musical numbers so the pacing of the storytelling is so quick so fast that if you can't if you can't read fast enough or you don't know the language you're gonna get lost because they, they speak so quick they move the story so fast there's so many different jump cuts you'll just see this guy he's talking like hey man let's go see your brother and they, they, they get over there and like no no establishing shot no nothing just quick cuts let's get this movie in in. let's get this plot in so we can have this big ass musical number that looks fantastic and crazy and that's it i personally like the movie if you don't like musicals or you don't like reading or you don't understand the culture this movie is definitely not for you if you do understand the culture i like i'm jealous because <laughs> this movie is it was great already like i liked it a lot but if i knew more about the culture i would have loved it even more and if you like action if you could find like a youtube clip or something and watch these action scenes they're so cool i wish there was action scenes like this in America where there's just these normal people and they could do supernatural action scenes for some reason. At the KR, he just stomps on the ground and cars just lift off the ground and he's like, he could punch them in different directions. It's crazy. Well, that's about it for this video. I gushed enough. I definitely like the movie, obviously. But if you're not into the Bollywood stuff and you don't know the culture and you don't like musical numbers that are 50% of the movie, this is not for you. But if you do, you're, you're in for a treat, man. You know what to do.